appreciate Ooh. that. Hey, you know what this is? What is that? It's pasteurized. <laughs> That's really good. Thank you. I like that one. We'll be here all week. <laughs> hey, Father's Day weekend is this weekend. Yes, it is. Speaking of dads and dad jokes. Mm -hmm. um, and if you don't know what to get a special dad in your life, how about something homemade? I think that's awesome. Right? And my father loves pickles. My father used mm. to make pickles. Oh, he did? Yeah, we used to have them in the basement, and he'd let them sit and soak for, like, the whole season, though. Wow, so you're a pickle expert. Well, I don't know about that. Are we going to find ourselves in a pickle with this? I think we are. Uh-oh. Here we go. All right, well, not only are we making pickles, by the way, but we're also going to finish finish up the hot sauce that Chef Terry Walters helped us make last week. I think it was a pineapple habanero. Okay, here All we right. go. So, you cut the pickles, and I'm going to smash some garlic. Cut tips off cucumbers. I can do that. Good job. How's and I just that? smashed this with a knife so I can easily. Aha! Look at you. Wow. And we were told by our producer that we don't even have to mince the garlic. You literally just throw the garlic cloves in. These are wonderful. Set it and forget it. Like That's this. really cool, though, that your dad used to make pickles. Yeah, he used to have a whole thing in the basement. And he'd make go down there, and next thing you know, three months later, we'd have pickles. Would you, how, did you have a lot of pickles? We had a lot of pickles. For all the boys, right? Yeah, all three of us. <laughs> all right, so the, that's done. Okay. Line bay leaves along inside wall of jar. Okay, so. Just throw them in back. You don't have to line it. Maybe we can help line it after the liquid's poured in. All right, so Two, the garlic's all set. Three. Four, five. And then we need the dill. Okay. We're gonna. Six, seven. I'll throw one in there for good measure. Layer the dill, too. Okay. Here's the garlic. How much? All of this dill back? All right. Okay. Well, well we, like, we like our pickles. I like my pickles dilly. Dilly dilly. Yeah. Don't be silly, Dilly. <laughs> there you go. And we have some peppercorns that need to be in there and fennel. Fennel. Where's the fennel? It's in front of the salt. Ah, fennel seeds. Okay. So we need a tablespoon of fennel seeds. That's a tablespoon. <laughs> this is actually going to be pretty good, I'm, I'm thinking. And a tablespoon of peppercorns. Okay, there we go. Oh, and the cucumbers. Going. I'm going to make the brine now. So I'm going to take two heaping tablespoons of coarse, of coarse kosher salt. This is two cups of water. Okay. My cucumbers are saying I won't stand for that. <laughs> They're really cute. Ooh, that's a lot of salt. Oh, I definitely put a lot of extra in. Okay. 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 Now we're going to mix it up until the salt dissolves. <laughs> How clever, though, this is. And look, we did this in like three seconds. I know. This is easy. And then you're going to let it sit, and these are going to... Where do the jalapenos idea. come in, Beck? Oh, i got to oh, put the jalapenos. jalapenos. Oh, so they're spicy peppers? All right. Well, we're going to go around. A little spicy... Uh, Becky was kind enough to slice up the jalapenos for us. And did you know that cucumbers are one of the harder vegetables to ferment? I did not know that. Mm -hmm. So the the bay leaves or the grape leaves, if you choose to use um, their tannins, keep the pickles crisp and prevent mushy cucumbers. Mm. Thank you, Chef Terry Walters, for that information. All right, now we're going to pour in the salt water. Brine. Brine, baby, brine. Ooh, a little bit of salt out. We're just gonna <coughs> throw that salt in. All right, then we seal it. This is the real deal. What a great idea. So how long do you seal it for? A week? Leave it for a week. A week ferment will yield a less sour and more crisp pickle. Longer fermentation will increase sourness. And when the taste is to your liking, you remove the weight, seal the jar, and refrigerate. Look how wonderful that is. What a great gift. Put a little bow on that, and you like that. I made you some pickles. Awesome. All right, now we're doing this. So we did this with Chef Ter Terry Walters yep. last week. Yep. And we put the water in the bowl. Into This was like all done in a jar. Pineapples. What was that kind of pepper was that? Habanero. Habanero. Mm -hmm. Some garlic. Just a little bit of water at first. This was the water that went, went into it. 
Good. I, I think the thick. The okay. more the water, I believe, the thicker the sauce, right? The less water, the thicker the sauce. No, I don't. The opposite of what I said. <laughs> Something like that. Okay. The blender is not plugged in. <laughs> we will plug it in. Hello, can you please then... plug the blender in? <laughs> A bit more. Add a little more water? Yeah. Yeah, I think, I think a little bit more. more. Let's see the consistency. Gosh, just, gonna... Oh gosh, this ninja is. Oh, uh, it's oh. spicy! <laughs> yeah, yeah, we definitely need some more. Okay. Oh, that that's a that hits you in the face. Where, where do we put it in? Put it back in the mason jar. Okay. Good job. <coughs> oh, it really wakes you up. Is it goes back in the mason jar? This might be spicier than Chef Terry's. Ooh, nice consistency. Ooh, it really is a good consistency. Are, are you gonna eat it? I'm gonna try. Ready? Hang on. What, what was the what was the name of the sauce that? Uh... I'm choking and I haven't even tasted it nope. yet. Be careful, Nicole. What do you think? Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. It's spicy. <laughs> All right, here we Ooh. go. That's good. It's good, though, right? It has a kick. That's got a kick. Woo! Mm. That's a whole kick line. It's very wow. good, though. It is really tasty. I think the pineapple really helps offset. It does. That. It offsets it. Well, it's delicious. Try mm -hmm. it out. It's all in Terry We Walter's should have Irene O'Connor taste that. Oh, my God. Woo! All right. Thank you so much. It was so much fun. We what, have this? Two great gifts for Dad. All homemade. All homemade right there. It's awesome. All right. Uh. Yeah, we're going <laughs> to find out if the pickles need to be burped. I don't think they do, Beck. I think you keep Burping, them in Burping, just so you know, is yeah. like unsealing. Going like this and resealing. And resealing. Yep. All right, what's coming up? Well, what is your...